Hi, my name is Dan. I use they, them pronouns. Having a space where anyone can come in and just immediately providing just a space with such like friendliness and welcoming, uh, like a welcoming aura. Like when you walk, like not currently, but when you would used to walk into the center, it was just immediately so cozy. And there were some drawbacks to it, like being a small center, but like that also meant that like it is personal and welcoming and almost like a little cozy second home. The TGNC group um, almost instantly like velcroed around me as a community once I started going, just because that's sort of the environment and the space that it produces. And it's just, it was life changing. I like spent like maybe the first month in New York, just kind of adjusting to a cross country move. And then I went and I'm like, oh, this is what friends are like in real life. This is amazing. I'm addicted to this. This is my drug now, friendship. And um, then it just snowballed from there. And here I am a year later. <laughs> it's been a year since I moved here. And shortly after moving here, I made it a routine to go to the groups weekly. Then I started going to other programs. They used to have D&D at the center, which was awesome. And I am still friends with the people who ran D&D there, which was, it's just wonderful. Like all of my friends that I have, ha I've met at the center. It's like, oh, this is where friendship happens. People without a community are so isolated and queer people and trans people, specifically that isolation just crushes you. Being able to make sure that space happens and that space is available is like one of the most important things in the world to me.